couldn't imagine I be living this lavish They stare when I'm passing Cause my diamonds do magic Suki a hood rat Hey guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. This is Valley for Viral. Last year, I made a video on Sukihana, the goat, exposing her deal with the devil. She said she sold her soul to the devil. You can check the video here, but let's do a quick review. Um, I got a message I want to give to my fans. Listen, I know y'all been watching my page and I've been depressed lately. Y'all, y'all don't know why, but. I want to tell y'all I apologize and I'm sorry for what I'm about to say, but as far as this music stuff, I won't be doing this music stuff anymore. I started this because this was my dream and, you know, I wanted to make sure I could get me and my kids out the hood. It's, it's always been my passion to rap. A while ago, I had signed a contract and I didn't know nothing about the business or the, or, or, the, or this game out here. And just right now, you know, I'm realizing that I signed my soul. I, I sold my soul to the devil. I signed myself to the devil. I don't even own myself no more. I don't, I sold my soul to the motherfucking devil and I done pray, I pray and I pray and I pray. You know, and it's just like, I don't know if God can get me out of this, you know, and it's just, it's just like to the point where I don't even know, like I can't, I just want to say I'm sorry to my fans. I know y'all love me. I know y'all believe in me, but I can't. I didn't know what I was doing back then and, and I lost passion. I, I don't even believe, but I don't even believe in myself no more because of what I did. I did not know the game was like this. And I'm just ready to go back to school. I'm just ready to move away and go to school at this point. But I just made the biggest mistake that I ever made. And I just hope, you know, if you're an artist, if you're an artist, make sure you have attorney to read over your contract and don't let the person that you signed it to pick the attorney don't let them pay for the attorney either because that mean the attorney working for them she said she has been praying hoping god will forgive her for what she did i was just curious to see the aftermath guys believe me she went from bad to worse anything negative about y'all now now, I never say that. I say I want the bitches to win. I don't give a fuck who y'all beefing with, but bitches want to keep bringing me in some shit, bitch. Then you, y'all sold pussy. Then y'all sell some pussy before. If you didn't, that's why you motherfucking broke now, bitch. You should have been selling that motherfucker. That's why your electric ain't on. Sell that bitch. This shit trash. Niggas don't want it. Give a fuck okay, about you pussy ass. Because okay, I'm tired of bitches calling me hoes. Like, don't call me no motherfucker hoe. Y'all really don't know what I did with my pussy. Y'all ain't never heard about a nigga fucking on me. Y'all ain't never heard about no nigga that ever fucked me, period. Bitch, I'm a businesswoman at the end of the motherfucking day. If I told you what I was really into, y'all bitches would be surprised. Y'all bitches don't know me. At the end of the day, I gotta do what I gotta do to, to feed my kids. So, bitch, if I wanna act like a motherfucking hell, bitch, I'll do that. I don't give a fuck. If I wanna say I stuck 30 motherfucking dicks, bitch, I'll say that. I don't give a fuck. Bitch, I don't care. I don't wanna be in the hood. That's your problem. Y'all don't know how hungry I am. When y'all bitches get like me, y'all get hungry. Y'all gotta understand you gonna do what you gotta do to make it out the motherfucking Damn! Before we get into this video, make sure you hit that like button, subscribe, share, and please leave your thoughts in the comment section. I always knew that if you try to run away from the devil and you don't go to Christ, the devil will send more demons to possess and haunt you. Yeah, like Jesus even spoke about this in the book of Matthew, chapter 12, verse 43. I had forgotten about her story till I saw her future in, in a video, this WAP video with Cardi B and Megan Thee Stallion. And what that pussy talk? Oh, this pussy talk, motherfucker. Pink, Hottest, 50, pink, blue hundreds. Hottest, shrimp, crab, all of this. Lobsters. Mm -hmm. English spell is a fridge. Mm. Cause the rex is blue hole. Um, 
about three, four months ago, you came out and you were one of the first people to be like, yo, I'm about to do this OnlyFans shit and I don't give a fuck what none of y'all got to say. I made this much my first day. I made this much and a lot of people was like, they was at your neck about it. They was calling you a whore. Yeah, fuck them. They was calling you a hoe. Yeah, we um, all hoes. You know, we is all hoes. All y'all bitches is hoes. If you fucking and you ain't married, bitch, you's a hoe too. If you done suck some dick, bitch, you's a hoe too. I just feel like shit. You can't knock, you can't knock the way a nigga eating if he breathing. And that's what Jay-Z said. Like, if a nigga breathing, you can't knock the way he eating. I'm a hustler. Like, I don't give a fuck what none of these hoes say. Scared money don't make no money. I can't be scared about what a bitch think about me. And that's why I'm rich as fuck. If I, if I ain't make my own things, like, first of all, it's a pandemic going on. Ain't nobody finna make me feel bad for trying to get a bag or trying to get a dollar. I got three kids. I got family. I got responsibilities. I'm a whole woman out here. I'm not a little ass girl. So when I made my own things, yeah, I made 20,000 the first couple days. And that, and that 20,000 turns into hundreds of thousands of dollars. I make money every day. And it, it be them bum ass hoes who be hating on a bitch. But right now, after I cop that Bentley on these puss ass hoes, that same day these bitches made them only fans. Them same rappers, them wacky, weak ass rappers made them only fans trying to be classy and tasteful. Bitch, you's a popper pussy hoe like the rest of us. Get that money, sis. I don't be hating on no hoes. Like, what's wrong with you, bitch? Like, what happened? I was a hoe. What? We all hoes now, bitch. Welcome to porn, bitch. You's a porn star now, hoe. And I don't give a fuck if you pop a pussy with a, with a song on. You's a porn star just like the rest of us, bitch. You see me, pussy ass hoe? Yeah. You see what I got on me? Yeah. You gonna be like this one day when you stop hating on a bitch hustle. Sukihana is a rapper from Atlanta. I know that life in Georgia is very hard. Everyone wanna leave the hood. So here's the storyline. Sukihana was raised from the mud crying dead tears. Her only way out was becoming a SpongeBob and leading a comm squad. She ended up signing a shitty deal with the devil. That's why she had to add goat on her name, Sukihana the goat. But she always calls herself Suki with a good coochie. When I speak about this young artist using the goat symbolism, people think I'm reaching. Yeah, like keep sleepwalking. Anyway, she said she wanted to take care of her kids and her grandma just like everyone else but look at what she got herself into some hoochie mama thing you so you let niggas fuck you for free it, so is that so you let niggas fuck you for free but that's that's that was self-respect is that what self-respect is so you because what what is self-respect what, what is self-respect because all your hoes is fucking all your hoes is fucking all your hoes done fuck all your hoes is getting fucked so what was self-respect because ain't none of y'all married because we going to take it back to the Bible where they say you can't fuck out of wedlock or have babies out of wedlock. Bitch, we all baby moms. We all done got... So wait. Because now I'm starting to think that it's just a manipulation tactic to make yourself feel like you better than the next bitch. That's what it's starting to sound like to me because bitch, you getting fucked too. You getting fucked in your coochie, your ass in your throat. And you put other women down because they tax niggas. Not because they prostitute them, because they brag about making a nigga cut a check. She ain't never said she was a prostitute, but she said she bragging about a nigga cutting a check because niggas do cut a check on her because she ain't scared to ask. But you feel like you too good to ask. And that's why you paying your own bills, bitch. So, one plus one equals... You a crackhead. That's what it equals. You a crackhead. She got famous by selling her soul to the devil to promote sexual promiscuity. Her words are so vulgar. Her punchlines are so perverse. She's living in this ultraviolet sex world that all she knows is being a whore 24-7. Sleeping with men up and down, promoting sex, perversion, boobs and dash enlargement, abortion and other shit. Her target audience are the younger generation, especially the black girls from these poor neighborhoods in Georgia and in other states in America. She has a lot of nasty songs on her YouTube channel and other social media networks. Back to the storyline. After promoting the devil's work and misleading these young kids on the path to hell, Sukihana had a Gucci bag, right? She had a Gucci money bag and she wanted to back out. She wanted to leave the Hoochie Mama game so that she can move on with her life. So the devil visited her, probably in her sleep, and tormented her soul. That's why she came out crying on selling her soul to the devil because she never went through her contract. Before she made that video, she was bad. But after that video came out, she became worse. Like she joined OnlyFans and she's been leaking some tapes. She's been even 
Here, right there. Is the reason I'm gonna buy you everything you want. What you want? The nigga use you up, and you ain't gonna put no tax on yourself. I thought that. I thought self respect is when you know your worth and you tax niggas. I didn't think that was prostitution. I thought that was self respect. I thought after you fucking nigga or you fucking with a nigga, he supposed to be helping you. I didn't know he was supposed to take, 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 take. I didn't know you was supposed to be cooking, spending your time, spending your conversation, spending, giving him your company, let him come up in your fucking house and I and I contribute. I thought that was. I thought that was no self-respect. I thought you was supposed to make a nigga pay his motherfucking way. Yeah. I thought that was, I thought that was morals. I thought, I thought making a nigga, sh uh. Her words in fact, she went hocho mocho. I'm like, I thought she was doing it for the money bag, but now she's already rich. She got like over 1.2 million followers on her Instagram and all that stuff. So she's rich. What's up with these ladies? Then I realized that she can't stop doing these things because those demons keep telling her to do what she's doing. You know, her new albums, her new music videos are even more perverse than the ones before. Gosh, like I feel so bad about her because deep within her eyes, I know that she hates her life so badly. Forget about those pretentious videos. She's just trying to like, keep up with her ego, but deep within her heart, she's hurt with pain and regret forget about the outside look and all that stuff so last month last month she made a tape and her shit went viral like many ladies came out and they were criticizing her then then she came back saying she got a ring on her finger she's been bragging about this guy which she calls her hobby yeah but i've been seeing him posting perverse videos like crazy bro like no real nigga would treat a lady like a hoe telling you to do shit for money and still love and marry you besides like people get divorced nowadays like crazy but i'm not wishing her bad in fact it's quite sad to watch this lady being used and tormented all her life people think this is fun maybe we're living in another sodom and gomorrah and we stay safe and we need to keep this thought thing out of our lives it's a virus that has traveled through the world our bodies at the temple of god yeah keep it holy the reward is large at the end of the game thanks for watching make sure you hit the like button subscribe and leave your thoughts in the comment section we need to get a demon of <laughs> we need to get a demon out of our lives pretty and ratchet 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 bitch you lost you lost this war, you lost the battle, you lost everything because you think that you're too good. And you judge women all motherfucking day, act like you better. But bitch, let me tell you something. These niggas said, hold on, what you said again? Hold on. You, you can't suck dick, the pussy trash, your breath stink. You be talking about all this other shit, niggas don't give a fuck. That's what they said. What, what else you said? Hold up. And you need to watch your dookie shooter. Bitch, you lost. So all you hoes out there that's acting like you better than us, next bitch, you're not. You're not. You're acting like you're better, but bitch, you really tired. You don't like that life. You don't like that life. You don't. You don't like that life. You don't like that. You don't like it. You don't like it. You're not happy. We can tell. You commenting on the other people's shit. You, you're always putting other people down. We know you're not happy, sis. I ain't saying you got to sell your coochie, but bitch, damn. Ask the nigga, can he take you out to eat? And stop going out to eat. Order a salad. Bitch, eat.